Um, hi guys, I'm going to record my September jewellery allowance. Um, I was actually going to record um, some this weekend but my computer did break which resulted in me losing some tutorials that I'd already um, put on my, comp on my computer but I haven't actually uploaded them to YouTube yet. Um, so all them will have to be redone. It was just about two or three I think. Um, so I will be, will be redoing them this week so they should be up after this one. Um, so I apologise I've not really done anything for a long time, it's just because I've been super busy and then my laptop broke, I've also started a new course and everything, so it's all a bit hectic. Um, but I have managed to record this and I did get this a few days ago, so I will get on with that. I'm going to show you the first things, as in like the order I don't like them maybe, I don't know. But anyway, uh, the first thing is a bracelet and um, it's £4 from... Madison Co. It's just a blue stringed beaded set of blue and green sort of bracelets on elastic. And I actually got these because they match the necklace I have, which I did show you in a previous video. And I'm also going to show you the ring right now. The ring is also £4 from Madison Co. I do feel like the ring should be a bit cheaper than the bracelets, but you know. I don't actually price them. It's the same sort of colours as you can see and it's one of these sort of spiralled um, metal sort of stretchy sort of ones so obviously you don't need a ring size. Um, these have improved though, they've improved because they're not actually being faulty anymore so the beads aren't actually coming off which I'm glad about. This one is slightly longer than the brown version of this that I've shown you in a previous video too. Um, and again if I didn't have the necklace then I wouldn't have bought these two to match because I don't really kind of, I kind of don't want them now I've got them, which has happened to me a lot with getting so much. And I forgot to mention that I'm showing you eight things and the total is £34.50. I'm going to show you a necklace now and it is my only necklace. Um, usually I do tend to buy necklaces just all the time, but I'm trying to like sort of balance with what I'm buying. So this one is £7, which I do feel is quite expensive for the reasons um, why I'm going to say in a minute because I've got a bad review on these. Uh, Manson and Co. It's again long with the knot and the beads at the bottom, just like the blue and green one I've shown before. It's sort of autumn colours, maybe sort of like burnt colours, rusty colours as it's described, and it's got browns, yellows, reds, and greens in it. Um, these beads at the bottom here. On my blue and green one, they have scratched off after only wearing it like two times, which I'm disappointed about, which is why I say they shouldn't maybe be worth £7, maybe £5 or five fifty, because Madison is obviously kind of a pricier brand. It's like the medium brand from the Madison store. Um, what should we do next? I'll do earrings next, and I'm going to show you, first of all, the ones that are in. I'll cover these two up. Um, it came in a set of six, which is £3 from Madison, which is a really, really good bargain for that particular sort of brand. Um, but I really, really like these ones, and they're just kind of handy earrings. They are studs, and these two are the silver ones. The other two are blue ones, which you can see here. I've got them in. I'll just sort of put my hand behind there. One is The front one you can see is the darker one, and the back one is the lighter one. So you can see that's what they look like and they just come in these slots instead but I've got another set of earrings in here. So I thought they were really really good and they just kind of go with quite a lot of things also or the jewellery I've got. Even though they are dark and I'm trying to stray away from that, um, it does match and they are just everyday earrings if you don't want to sort of style your outfit up with specialised sort of earrings then they're just nice just, just to wear. The other one is £2.50 which I think is a bargain really. but kind of more expensive because I've just got six earrings for three pound and now I've just paid two pound fifty for one so that's kind of pricey but they do are more um details and they're just a pair of silver studs again but they are snake skinned as you can kind of see the pattern here so yeah so you kind of are getting a bit more from the, your money as well there and I just thought they were good for just everyday earrings just random earrings and earrings as I said if you don't want to sort of style up with earrings um, I'm going to show you that earrings last I'm going to move on to bracelets now and I have taken this off the card as I wore it today so I will just show you that now card is Destiny and it's £5 which I think is reasonable for the, for the detail and stuff on it it's a pearl elasticated bracelet but it's sort of that um, pink pearls. Um, I'm 
just looks like this and then look at how beautiful those designs on the bottom are. You've got a really lovely flower here and a bow, a pearl and these lovely gold um, sort of thread strands almost like they're just so delicate and the only thing I can complain about this item of jewellery is when you wear it you can arrange it so you either wear them down or you wear them the opposite way but when you're tilting your hands up and down maybe to reach up for something or to write these do get tasseled up, um, tangled up sorry, quite a lot um, the second bracelet I have for to show you is £4 from Destiny to show you that and compared to the price of the one I just showed you £5 I think this one should be a lot cheaper because they're only string bracelets but it does have nice designs on them so I guess maybe that's why they're priced at £4 um, I really really into string bracelets at the moment I'm not quite sure why because they kind of remind me of like children's friendships bracelets or whatever but they kind of really kind of like them at the moment and this pink is so pretty colours pink and purple that's why I bought them you can, they come as a set but obviously you can split them up and wear them individually and this is what they come with a pink stone and star and a bird and a pearl let's try and show you that a bit closer the lighting's quite like bad especially with the stone next to my skin colour on my hand it doesn't really show up too well um, but I just think they're so pretty and they do go with quite a lot of things I've got and I do quite like to wear just random stringed bracelets maybe just to shove on a bracelet or when you're not trying to match your style up your outfit the last thing I'm going to show you is back to earrings but it is still on Destiny and still at £5 they are gold earrings and they are long I don't usually go for long earrings because my hair is quite thick um, and they sort of kind of get tangled all in my hair and but when it's curly it's even worse and so I probably only wear them if I maybe clip half my hair up or I do have my hair up with maybe just a bit of fringe down that's when I'm probably going to wear them and again they'll go quite nicely with the bracelets I just showed you or a necklace I've got that's pink and gold that I have shown before in these videos I think it was last month then I kind of want to use them with that or for more delicate soft outfits or occasions and I'm trying to always stay, stay away from the darker colours and just ignore the blue bracelets etc that I've just got this time but I'm trying to go for more girly, delicate, sort of pretty jewellery maybe because I've kind of changed my style as well as in clothes as well these past few weeks so it's a long gold chain and just this design here I'll try to zoom but I've had problems with my lighting um, which I know people have um, said about this is a white bird I can see that this is roughly showing up and on the bottom you can kind of roughly see that's its cage and there that ball you can see sticking out kind of is showing up as pearl and it's a sort of pink pearl pink charm on there but I thought they were super, really super cute and I'm kind of drawn to animal sort of things at the moment it's quite a lot of like frogs, birds, um, little bears, cupcakes that sort of like delicate animal sort of children's sort of affair that kind of made up into a woman's fashion um, jewellery sort of so it's kind of really nice and I'm really glad I purchased these actually because I actually saved these for um, on my jewellery allowance for my mum actually um, but then I decided oh yeah I get two pairs and that's why I've got these ones so that is the end of the haul and as I explained at the start of the video I will be recording the makeup tutorials um, I can't I can roughly remember what I did but to be honest I think I'm going to be using different colours roughly because I don't actually have what I had with me at the moment as I'm not at home again as you can tell by the background so I will probably see you soon and straight after this one so